Hey there guys, it's Kata Hain back again with some Dark Souls 3. Here we are in the dark land of the untended graves. Is this the past? Are we in an alternate timeline? You can say for sure. All I know is that having to deal with uh, old champion Gundir at in his prime, not weighed down by the, the blight of the abyss as he was when we first faced him as a Udix Gundir, was a excruciating fight but we beat him we discovered what firelink held for us the handmaiden many silver knights the um hornet ring with a fair and great or fair and blade sitting there a few different items like the eyes of the firekeeper and yeah just in general many many questions of course it seems to be the case that the Silver Knights set out an expedition to the uh, Firelink Shrine, perhaps in the attempts to rekindle the fire, but it's clear to see that we are definitely in an age of darkness. There is nothing in the sky, no light. Most of the fires that burn are nearly, um, well, have nearly dwindled out. So, here we are. We're going to head back to Firelink Shrine and see what's changed, because the real Firelink Shrine, perhaps in the future, in our current timeline, and uh, just check out what's going on there because I feel like uh, some of our people like the uh, firekeeper might have something to say about the items we picked up I don't know if I want to give her the firekeeper's eyes I feel like that might drive her totally mad but uh, well we'll see what she has to say about it alright immediately a little bit of a nicer ver version of uh, Harling Shrine if I do say so myself oh uh, with Andre alive too I wonder if that was the past then, if that's what I th I'm theorizing. Why was his blacksmith hammer left there? Hmm. Hello. Welcome home, Ashen One. Speak that. Oh man, should we do it? Ashen One, have I suffered? Wondering about. Oh man, should we do it? No, I don't want to. All right, fine. Ashen One, are these? Are these eyes? How gracious of thee, Ashen One. The very things we firekeepers have been missing. Oh god. Okay. I feel like I've done something terribly wrong. Uh oh. I think the music has changed. Ashen One, my thanks for the eyes thou's given. Uh oh. Firekeepers are not meant to have eyes, it is forbidden. These will reveal through a sliver of light, frightful images of betrayal. A world without fire. Ashen One, is this truly thy wish? Oh man. I think it is. I think we need to go to Null State, but that... Oh, the music's taking a, a dreadful tone. Of course. I serve thee. And will do as thou bidst. This will be our private affair. No one else may know of this. Stay thy path. Find lords to link the fire. And I will blindly tend to the flame. Until the day of thy grand betrayal. Oh my dear. I think this is what's best for the world. We need to bring it back to the null state, but... Ashen One. Oh, man. Forgive me if this sounded strange. The eyes show a world without fire. A vast stretch of darkness. But tis different to what is seen when stripped of vision. In the far distance, I sense the presence of tiny flames. Like precious embers, left to us by past lords, linkers of the fire. Could this be what draws me to this strangely enticing darkness? I'm telling you, it's what it has to be. The only, only by allowing the cycle to, I guess, that was even the word for it, to renew itself through darkness. That's the only way that we're going to come back to what, how it was meant to be. Ashen will kill me. And oh, so I will return as the firekeeper I once was, as it has always been. What? Ashen one, if thine heart should bend, 
kill me and strip these eyes from my person. I will return as the Firekeeper I once was, as it has always been. Farewell, Ashen One. Mayst thou thy peace discover. So if we kill her, she will come back, but we can take the eyes off her and she'll have never remembered that we we spoke of this or that she saw the vision of the darkness with the, the flames burning specks in. Oh man. Oh, this is some heavy stuff and the music has changed. Oh, I don't know if I, what I'm doing is right. But we must stay the course. We have to bring darkness to this world, no matter how, how much suffering it brings down upon those who live in the cycle now. I think it's honestly the only way to stop this. Ah, well met. How many? What have you for me, Margaret? Uh, do you have... Ah, uh, there it is. Gundir's Helm. Ancient helms uh, of a set of cast iron armor belonging to the champion Gundir, modeled after a former king. Gundir, or the belated champion, was bested by an unknown warrior. He then became a sheath to a cold sword in hopes that someday the first flame would be linked once more. So, I think that further gives us evidence to believe that that was the past. Gundir, being a champion, having not been summoned by the bell, but uh, coming to Firelink Shrine of his own uh, volition, discovered that there was no firekeeper and no flame for him to uh, champion the linking of. So, having no place and uh, no purpose, he sat down at the bonfire, and of course we stumbled upon, or er, at the candles rather, and we stumbled upon him then, having cheesed him with great chaos fire orb, <laughs> we killed him, and I guess this is sort of um, implying that we thrust the coil blade into him, or perhaps that we left and he took up the coil blade and thrust it into him, in hopes that one day somebody strong enough could take the coiled sword out best him in his state of abyssal corruption and go on to link the flame oh man it's a beautiful set of armor that's for sure very heavy probably won't pick it up and that's what you get after defeating Udix Gundir also on a titanite scale here we could buy it I'll leave it Ashen Wandering Wizard <laughs> Ashen One of course you're always so desperate for souls Andre what have you say of this? Ah, it is good, wasn't it? Weapons and but went, but I absolutely so. nothing. Thank you, Andre. Oh man, let's do some upgrading. What we got? Titanite chunks for the washing pole. We could do that. We need a titanite slab for the Morian blade. Let's uh, throw an upgrade into the washing pole. Why not? And now we can't upgrade. Look at that. 151 titanite shards. Ridiculous. Thank you, Andre. We get Estus now. Pretty be careful, I go. <laughs> oh, you're, you're always such a a joyful companion. Ah, there you are. <laughs> he the hundred. Nah, nothing. Oh, we'll leave you. What is it? Praise the sun. Oh, indeed. Oh, all right. We'll talk with the little king and see what items we can transpose with Gundir's soul. So, the eyes show a world destitute of fire, a barren plain of endless darkness, a place born of betrayal. So, I willed myself, Lord, to link the fire, to paint a new vision. What is thine intent? The eyes are... Hmm, uh, many of you demanding of me my answer to what I intend for the world and using heavy words like betrayal. Not keen on that, friend, but maybe you're correct. A oh, life's hunt scythe. Soul of consumed Osaros. Ah, source of the deluded consumed king Os Osaros? Oh, we'll just start. Osaros. Emits crystal breath of Seath the scaleless crystal breath has piercing qualities. Seath's research seemed to strike a chord with old Big Hat. Who in his mad disrobed state made divine work such as this his own. 
Oseros was no doubt edified by this. Uh, and the Moonlight Great Sword, of course. Legendary Dragon Weapon associated with Seep the Pale Drake charged a strong attack to its limit to unleash Moonlight Wave. Oseros, the consumed king, was infatuated with the search for Moonlight, but in the end, it never revealed itself to him. Eyes, eyes on the inside. And... Ah, Gyundir's Halberd. Halberd of Gyundir, the champion, received when he was charged with his duty. The old cast iron halberd has the power to break poison and is said to never crumble. Seeming to su suggest that Gyundir was fated to eternal service from the beginning. And the prisoner's chain. Portion of a steel chain used to restrain Gyundir. Gain vigor, endurance, and vitality, but take extra damage. Prisoner is one who has staked everything on a belief, a proclivity most apparent in the greatest of champions. Now uh, we should, I think we'll get the prisoner's chain. And perhaps, uh, we'll go with White Dragon's Breath. Even though the Moonlight Greatsword is something beautiful. And why not the Life Hunt Scythe? Or... Ooh, or the Dark Moon Longbow. Yeah, why not? The eyes uh, so nothing new for me. Oh. Iria. Iria, you might have some answers for me. Liege, speak freely, thy lordship. O oh, lord, and I prithee, when the, the age of fire was found at the god of. Be safe. I Man, I, I feel like I'm being played by both sides here. Those who wish to link the fire do so only in the blind belief and fear of the age of darkness. But those who wish to see the flame, I suppose, usurped are seemingly very deceptive in their their methods as well, like within Dark Souls 1, Kaith, and of course, um, the other one. I can't remember his name. Damn, I, I wish there was a middle- I think there is a middle path I can take, but I just don't know what it is. I do wish to see the Age of Dark come about, but... Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm having some major conniptions. Ah, uh, alas, oh well. We have the items we need. We should carry on through the uh, Lothric, Castle Lothric, and find ourselves the last, the last of his line, Prince Lothric himself. Or, well, of course, we can always head to the Dragon's Peak and see what that's about. Uh, I kind of do want to check it out. I feel like there might be some answers there for us, so let's head down to... Oh, what's the quickest way? Profane Capital? Or Ithril Dungeon? Ithril Dungeon, I think. Oh, the music of Firelink is... Oh, it really eats away at me. <laughs> it's a, uh, it's eating away at my uh, my will to follow through with this mad plan. Uh, let's swap. Do some spell swaps. Let's grab our Blackfire Orb back, and we'll grab... Oh, what do we want? What do we want? What do we want? We can't even use? Oh my god, that 50... 50 intelligence to use that. Jesus, okay. Uh, we'll grab Great Deep Soul and we'll grab... Uh, we'll grab the buff. Yeah. Oh, hello. Um, I forgot that we're kindled, so we're probably going to get invaded. And... I can't wield this without going overweight. We'll keep the Fire Clutch Ring on. We'll swap the Great Swamp Ring with um, the Bellowing Dragon Crest Ring. Alright. I believe it was this way, if I'm not incorrect. And we'll see if we can't get to Dragon's Peak somehow. If we get like picked up by a dragon and, and brought over there, I'm... Oh man. That's gonna be a, That's gonna be something. And down we go. What we got here? We should see if we can put on some of Artorias' stuff. I think it's it's actually it seems lighter than um, the brass armor we're wearing. Uh, less magic resist, less lightning resist, but not by much. It almost looks honestly better overall with lighter. It it's lighter. Oh, okay. So this is. 
We lose a good bit here though. But and it's it's a one point lighter. Almost should just leave that on. Um Wolf Knight Gauntlet? That's what he was, yeah. Three. Ooh, that's a lot heavier. A lot better. And of course the set of the bottoms, Wolf Knife Leggings, quite much more heavy. Well the helmet's different, but it makes us kinda look terrible, so no, I'm sorry Artorius, I love you, but we'll just go back to using the brass set. Alright, so this way. Run away from the rats. And up, 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 up. Oh, wait, is this right? Hello. We have to jump down. Oh man, I've already forgotten where to go. It's by. Oh wait, it's by where all the the dudes are, right? So we have to go this way. Oh man, there's still a crystal lizard here, isn't there? Oh, can we do this? I feel like he's still gonna beat our ass too. Ah, uh, giant. I really don't want to fight you. Oh, ow. Oh, that almost knocked me off too. He's got a lot of health. My rats. Oh, you bitch. No. You died. Well, I think that crystal lizard gets to live. We won't bother him. Hello. Rats, we meet again. I missed. Oh, I missed again. <laughs> oh, shit. That's not a daughter rat. Alright. I should not have used that. Look at all these bastards. Uh, I should probably should be using Chaos Fire Orb just so I can get that AoE, but no big deal. Yeah. Hey, little puss. Huh? Oh, you want some too? Take that. We'll take care of the big rats and then we'll take the fast track to Dragon's Peak. Ow. Oh, we're on the wrong side. We're on the wrong side of the law. Oh, shit. They're comboing us. Oh, you bastards. Get out of here. And let's just avoid these assholes. Oh god, we're breaking things. Don't pay any attention to me. Here it is. We shall follow the path of the dragon. Oh. Oh, okay. Maybe that we... We're being summoned in. Maybe we only needed to... Oh, no, no. <laughs> Every single time I think that something interesting is going to happen with the game, I get summoned in as like a blue sentinel or as a, a blade of the dark moon. <laughs> I always think it's the game, like, having some cool thing. Oh, man. Whoa. Two of us. Let's do this, man. Oh, we got summoned to Dragon's Peak, too. Uh, all right, spoilers. Sorry, guys. <laughs> spoilers for the level. Oh, oh, no. No, we're in a thrill dungeon. Okay, that was weird. That looked strange out there. Oh, hello, Michael. What's going on here? I'm, I'm terribly confused. Did he, like, pop fingers and... There's a bunch of red somewhere, or what's going on here? Huh. We're just tell <laughs> Are we just gonna help him out, like, go through this, uh, ethereal dungeon? I mean, I'm not against doing that. I'm just worried that there's gonna be some red somewhere. Uh, I don't see any. It doesn't look like we're affected by the Jailer's, uh, bad touch. How strange. We'll just have to keep ourselves alert. Oh. Make sure that there's no uh, no reds show up. I wonder where the hell they could be. Huh. 
<laughs> How strange. Why do I always end up in these really awkward and uh, just really strange PV or uh, I guess technically this can be considered PVP. PVP uh, instances. Where'd this, where'd, where'd this guy go? Why's he going this way? Where you going, mate? Summoning another phantom. Did he summon? There's no way he summoned us in. There has to be reds here. I saw the the sign go down. What was that? Visions of fear. He put down two. Yep. Hey, there we go. Oh, he returned home. There we go. Well, I got my ear, I guess. <laughs> How strange. All right. All right, let's do this. Path of the Dragon. Oh, I didn't want to switch that, actually. Oh, man, what was there? Because my bat was there, wasn't it? Hold on. Swap that. No. Swap that. Switch. Oh, my God, where are we going? What are we doing? Here we go. Test. Hey. 